Hi you guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm gonna be sharing everything that I'm putting in the kids' Easter baskets this year in today's vlog. It's gonna be a typical day in the life. We are actually heading out here in just a little bit as soon as Grayson wakes up from his nap to go take pictures with the Easter Bunny at our local mall. And then I think we're gonna go to the Cheesecake Factory depending on if there's a long wait or not. But once we get back and we put all the kids to bed, I'm gonna fill the kids' Easter baskets with you guys. And a lot of the stuff is from Amazon or Walmart, so I'll have everything linked down below. And I'm pretty sure all this stuff is still on Amazon Prime, so you can get it in time for Easter. So I'll share all of that later tonight. the next morning I kind of fell off on vlogging last night after we got home we went to the cheesecake factory and it was not our best outing I'll just say that the Easter Bunny though everyone did so great so I'm talking it up as a win um, but after we got home we put the kids to bed and I was just exhausted so I'm gonna do the Easter baskets today I'm at Orange Theory right now I just pulled up just dropped off all the kids at school and I'm a little early so it's a new day and a new week this is our first week since not having our nanny that's like a typical week so last week was spring break obviously um so our schedule looks a little bit different but this is like our first normal week without alexis now that all the kids are back in their normal school routine so yeah we had our first morning and it went really well adam is dropping off grayson grayson goes to school later than um bailey and shay do so i drop bailey and shay off and then i swing by Tatum school drop her off and then it leaves me like the perfect amount of time I'm actually early to make my orange theory class so I'm gonna go work out and then I'll head home and start working on all the Easter stuff okay back home from orange theory I just showered and got ready I'm gonna fill the kids Easter baskets now I use the same Easter baskets that I have for four or five years maybe four years I think I got them from Pottery Barn and I just reuse them every year. You guys probably remember these, but I'm missing Grayson's little tag. I got them from a small shop. They sent it to us like a few years ago and I don't know where his went. So I need to order another one. I can't remember the small shop name. So I'm gonna have to try and figure that out. But these are the liners. It says the kids' names on the ears right here. Um, and then the baskets are also from Pottery Barn and they're really really good quality I mean, I use them every year and I just store them in our garage and then pull them out every Easter so Most of the stuff I got for the kids is from Amazon and Walmart, so I'll link as much as I can below But let's go ahead and start filling the kids baskets So I hide everything like in our room somewhere and I just keep everything in bags and I sort it by each kid so it just makes it really easy. So when like Amazon packages and stuff would come in, I would just sort them in the baskets and now everything is already organized. So I just have to put everything in the basket. So it makes it really easy. This is also what I do for the kids' stockings for Christmas too. Wait a second, I don't need you Then why so settled, I miss with you Still it feels just like I'm waiting for Something better, wait a second I wanna stay up late with my heart 
heart in your head Maybe stand too much Cause you don't understand You got me Okay, I just finished. I'm gonna show you guys what I put in each of the kids' baskets this year. So each of the kids got a pair of Crocs. This is like a blush pink. I got that same color for Bailey and Shay. This is Bailey's basket. Um, this tumbler is so cute. It's from Walmart. I think it was like $5. And then I got them each a little pouch to put whatever they want in. This one says my things in it. It looks like a stony clover pouch. Really cute. I think that was five bucks too from Walmart. And then I got them a Mad Lips and then a color by number. They are obsessed with these color by number books and it keeps them entertained for so long. I found out, I discovered at Disney when I packed them for our trip, they love them. So I found an Easter theme one for them. And then these little peep gummies I thought were really cute. And then a little chocolate bunny. And oh, this is a lip gloss. It came in a pack of two, so I gave Bailey the clear one, and then I'll show you the color I put in Shay's basket. And then some little Easter eggs. These are chocolate Easter eggs. And then some plastic ones that I'm gonna fill with candy. This is Shay's, pretty much the same thing. This is her pouch, so cute. And then this is the other lip gloss from Amazon. I think they were like 10 bucks, but I thought they were cute for the Easter basket. Um, and then this is everything I put in Grayson's. So he got light blue Crocs. This is a Bible sticker activity from Amazon. A little book, a dot marker coloring book, some Peeps bubbles, and some candy. And then these are the Crocs and Pepper Tatum. They're so cute. They have sparkles on them. And then same thing, she got the little Bible coloring book, or a sticker book a different Jesus Loves Me book, dot marker coloring book, some candy, some pink Peeps bubbles, and I think that's it. So I'll link everything down below, but everything was really inexpensive from Amazon and Walmart. I also wanted to show you guys what we're gonna be wearing for Easter this year in case you need ideas. These dresses are from Amazon, they're so cute. This is Bailey's and Shay, so they're wearing the same dress. And then this is Tatum's. The back is really cute too. Um, has the buttons in the back. And then these shoes, they wore to meet the Easter Bunny. So they're going to wear the same shoes with this dress too. Grayson's button up hasn't come in yet. And I need to check the shipping on that because I ordered it like a week and a half ago. But this is when I ordered him. These jeans are from Amazon. He needed some new jeans that fit him and they actually do fit. So if you have toddler boys with a really small waist but they have long legs, um, this will be linked in my like to know it. Um, and then I'll show you guys the dress that I ordered for myself. I desperately need to steam this. Obviously I just took it out of the packaging but I love how it ties up here on the shoulders. It zips in the back and then it's like tighter around the waist and then it like poofs out at the bottom. I think these are the shoes that I'm gonna wear on Easter too. And then if you need kids Easter pajamas, these are the ones that I got for the kids. This is Tatum's and then Bailey and Shay have the same print from Amazon and then this is Grayson's. So I'll link these below too. This is the Easter craft that I'm gonna do with the kids when they get home from school today. I thought it was really cute and really easy. You just need colored construction paper, some scissors and a pink marker and a pen. And then you can make a cute little bunny out of their handprint. I love doing handprint crafts for holidays so I can look back and see like how big their hand was. So I thought this was a really cute idea. And then this is the Easter treat I'm gonna do with the kids after dinner tonight. I'm pretty sure I did the flowers one year, like a few years ago, but how adorable are the butterflies and then the little Easter bunnies, so cute. So I got some pretzels, some Easter pastel M&Ms, and then the melting wafers, the white chocolate melting wafers. So that's all you need for that treat. And then I saw this idea on 
TikTok. Let me see if I can find it on my phone. It's like the easiest little DIY Easter cupcake. So I got the plain cupcakes and then some peeps that I'm gonna use to stick in with like a toothpick and then some Cadbury eggs to decorate it a little bit. So those will be the two treats that we do tonight after dinner. I just realized I forgot to show you guys the final photo that we got from taking pictures with the Easter Bunny this year. So here it is. All the kids are looking at the camera and three out of four are smiling. Tatum's like, what is going on? But she actually loved him. And so did Grayson. Grayson gave him a big hug like twice. Tatum gave him a high five. So it was a success. Okay, and then I'll share a couple other things that I got from Amazon for Easter. I got these Easter egg decorating kits from Amazon too. You put the egg in and it like spins and it comes with markers to decorate them with markers instead of, I don't know what that was, instead of dying Easter eggs. I thought that would be a fun alternative. I have no idea what that sound is. Oh, I think it's my alarm. <laughs> to go pick up the kids. Okay, really quick. Um, charades for Easter. I got like a few Easter games to do with the kids. And I think this is pin the tail on the bunny, or uh, yeah, on the bunny. Um, it comes with like a little face mask or eye mask too. And then what is this? Oh, this is Easter bingo. This is also from Amazon. So a few fun little games to play on Easter morning. Ellen and Maverick are gonna be here spending Easter with us. So that'll be really fun, but my alarm's going off. I'm gonna go pick up the kids from school. Bailey and Shay just got home from school. They're gonna do the Easter craft. You guys want a snack? This mango cutter is the best thing ever. If you don't have this, you need to get it. It cuts it perfectly every time. And this is one of the kids' favorite fruits. They love mango, right? That was my idea to get the mango cutter because I thought it was the pineapple one. No, I, I Oh yeah, that's right. Yeah. It was your idea. Whose idea was, was the pineapple? Um, is that Shay? Or maybe I found it on TikTok, I can't remember. But we also have a pineapple cutter that cuts pineapple perfectly every single time. You just twist it in and then you pull up and slide it off and it cuts it so perfectly. You're done? Nice, now fold these ones back. Shay said she messed up on hers so she's gonna try again. So yeah, you want your thumb up like that? Can I just this? I want my one of the USB kind of folded down. That's cute. Good job. Can you write your name on the back and the date or the year? Bailey 2024. Okay, but I have to show you guys this mango cutter because it's so cool. I saw so it, it cuts on, it like I that. I saw it on YouTube so it's like... And you did? That could be useful. And then all of this is just the core, which I can probably cut a little bit of the mango off there. But, oh, look, I cut my hand off. Nice. So you leave the two ring finger and the pointer finger as the ears. Yep. Perfect. I want it to look like at the arms, so I'm going to put one the arms. I just finished hers. I'm going to hang it on the, um, in the fridge. Yep. Okay, I love how you guys make them your own. Bailey made a little carrot for her bunny. And the tummy, and I will put it. That's so cute. Wait, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. Bailey made two of them. I'm gonna do something really funny. Well, you can tape it like that. Yeah, I'm, gonna I'm gonna do something really funny. What are you gonna do? <laughs> What's the tape? Yellow tape. In the drawer. I yellow tea. <laughs> yes, yellow tea. <laughs> the girls have pajama day at school today. That's why they're in pajamas. And what's tomorrow? It's dressed like a teacher day. And what are the teachers doing? Dressing like a student. <laughs> so I got the girls these. So I got these from Amazon. They're like teacher clips. And they stretch really fast. <laughs> and um, it's like a little clip. 
You can put it on your outfit. And then you clip it to the top. My paper. Want me to show you what we're making? Look. We're gonna make a bunny out of your hand. See? <gasps> what is that? It's a bunny. It is a bunny. You ready? Put your hand right here. You wanna do yellow or purple? Purple. Okay. So put your hand like this. Good job. Now we gotta trace it. Ready? Yeah. Okay. Hold still. How big your hand's getting? Look, that's Tato's hand. Okay, now we gotta cut it out. What are these called? Scissors. Scissors. Hop like a bunny. Hop, hop, hop. Hop like a bunny. Hop, hop, hop. Hop like a bunny. Hop, hop, hop. So can you fold this one over? Yeah. Can you fold it? Fold it down like this. Push. Good job. And we got to fold this one down. Good job. And then we got to cut the middle finger off. So now it has bunny ears. Hey, okay, we got two pink ears. And then we got to do his eyes. Can you draw a circle? Yeah. Right here for eyes. One eye and two eyes. And then we need to draw his his nose. Circle right there. Okay. And do mouth. And this. And then his little feet. Should we go put it on the fridge? Yeah. Like we're gonna make an Easter bunny. See? Can you put your hand out like this? Good job. Lift up. Good job. Now we're gonna cut it out. Tatum, what's wrong? Tatum. Hey. Cut it. Okay. Tatum, come here. Hold. One. And then fold the pinky finger. Now look, it's a bunny. One. Two. And then we gotta draw the whiskers. One, two, three. One, two, three. And then we gotta do the nose. And then we gotta make the mouth. Ready? Mouth. Mouth. And then the paws. And then we gotta do the ears. Ears. Ready? What color is this? Pink. Pink. <gasps> what is that? Yeah. A bunny. 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 Yeah. Now we gotta draw your name. V. R. A. A. Y. Y. S. O. Grayson. Great job, bud. Yeah. All done. And we gotta go put it on the fridge. Here's how all of the kids' bunny hands turned out. So this is Bailey, Shay, Tatum, look how small her hand is, and Grayson. So cute.
These turned out so cute. Grayson made this one and this one. Tatum made that one and she's eating one. <laughs> Love it, Shay. I'm almost done. I did it, I'm, all, I'm done. I'm they done. look great. I'm done, I'm done. I I'm love done. them. Cute. Good job, you guys. Now we gotta put them on a tray. Bailey and Shay are working on the other treat. Making some butterflies. Just gonna have a handful of these, cause it's kinda of hard to grab from the other side. Butterflies, little bunnies, and flowers. I think it's gonna be hard to bake the butterflies. I'm preheating the oven right now to 250. Oh, it just got preheated. So once you guys are done, we can stick them in and then we can decorate it with the M&Ms. These turned out so cute. The butterflies are my favorite. Okay guys, I think I'm gonna end today's vlog here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please give it a thumbs up if you did. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. Tell me what, what you wanna do. I'll do anything. As long as I can be here with you, everything's all right. Stay here with you.